George, welcome to the BTCC Winners Enclosure. How high does this high feel? Unbelievable. Um, I've not raced for a couple of years and it's, it's been such a journey to get back racing and I was, I was so emotional on the in-lap. Like, this is, you know, something I've dreamed of since I was 14 and Jeanette Junior's like winning a race in British touring cars. And um, I, just, I just can't thank everyone involved enough, like the team, the sponsors, everyone that made this happen. It, uh, I really wouldn't be stood here without it. I can hear the emotion in your voice. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah, it's uh, it's such a feeling that was. Yeah, just to leave lights to flag and you know the times that we were putting in, it was just consistent and uh, just managed to build a gap, manage it, and yeah, it's just a picture perfect race. Uh, I just can't I can't believe it. Yeah. It's fantastic when they come like that. I mean, Steve just described it as a dominant win. You were seconds off up the road, weren't you? At what point did you allow yourself to relax and think, I've got this? I think the last lap, I was a bit cautious. You know, I could feel the, the life of the tyres going and the brakes and stuff. I just didn't want to do a silly error, but um, yeah. The, the, if you was to picture your race win, that's exactly how you'd want it, you know, and, and what, a, what a feeling. I just, I can't believe it. It's, it's so unbelievable. You were, you were so nervous on the line, but now you've done it, it's it's kind of got that monkey off your back. It's a nice monkey to have there, but, you know, almost an up was from here, really, isn't it? Definitely, yeah. We, we opened at Donington, obviously, with a strong podium. We've just had a couple of rocky rounds with bad luck and, you know, no fault of anyone's, but, you know, just to, to come back. All day we've been strong. We've got, you know, two independent wins, a fifth, a seventh, and then, you know, uh, an overall win, Jack Sears and an independent in the last race. So I've got three trophies, so it's unbelievable. Congratulations, fantastic. Enjoy that champagne that's coming your way. And Jake, what a day you've had. Yeah, yeah that's, uh, I'm a little bit happier after that last one. Fantastic result. Um, obviously, you know, Tom and Shedden got into each other, I think, at turn three straight away, which obviously helps the likes of me and Colin coming through. So, yeah, fantastic result. Um, I owe a big, big thank you to to Colin and his engineer, John, and the team for uh, letting me have a go at Rory at the end there. Um, and obviously it paid off. So, yeah, and also a big well done to George. First win. Uh, I had my first win here as well. So it's, yeah, really very fitting. Well done him. I can imagine Dick Manitz was getting a bit nervous on the pit wall looking at you and Colin in close succession. I, it kind of felt like Colin went, all right, mate, have it. Yeah, well, I mean... We, you know, we have been very quick this weekend. There's no two ways about it. I got my mojo back in that, in the you know after sort of lap three of that last race, and I was really on it again. And you know, I was catching Colin, Rory, and George quite quickly, and you know, they were good enough to let me have a go, and obviously try and pass Rory. So, um, yeah, I'm just thrilled with that weekend, Lou. And obviously, we're only 14 points away from the championship lead now, which is a, a massive bonus. Well done, and well done also to to Rory Butcher. Ending with the Scott on the podium, that's always a good day at Knock Hill, isn't it? Well, I either needed to be me or Gordon. Um, we were the ones at the front there, weren't they? And, uh, you know, that's the great thing about touring cars. They, they got this reverse grid and it gave me a chance there to have a go at trying to get a race win, give George a hard time. Um, but it was, uh, it was hard to make inroads. It was just, they were just strong coming out of Clark and out of the hairpin and they just kind of pulled up the straight through the back. I felt like I could reel them in a bit and uh, as soon as Colin got on my tail, it, it kind of spiced things up and I let George got away. Had a quadruple champion on my tail, followed by the pole sitter. Um, and I just did my best to hang on. The last five laps, no hybrid. Yeah, I deserve a drink, I think. Well done. Well done. You hung on really, really well there. Um, as I've just said to the other guys, there's some champagne waiting for you to drink. So I'll... I'll... Louise, do you mind if I just say thanks to my team? Because uh, they've worked so hard over the weekend. Um, we really did struggle in practice and, and in race one. And I just want to say a massive thank you. So those guys work super hard and, and it paid off in the, the, the last two races. They'll appreciate that. Well done.